Hi everyone! I wanted to make this video to remind you of the three major reasons your recorder might squeak. Reason number one, blowing too hard. This is definitely the most common reason that we have for our recorders squeaking. In the blue circle we have a great tip to help make a good sound. If you look there it says to check blow very gently on your palm like you're trying to melt a snowflake. Do you feel how warm that is on your hands? That's the kind of air we want. If you pucker your lips to feel the air come out in a steady stream, you're going to feel that that air on your palm gets colder. We want that warm, gentle air to make a good sound. Don't be like the birthday boy you see over on the right. If you blow that hard, you know your recorder is going to squeak. Just remember, less is more. It seems like the opposite of the way it should be, but you really only need a tiny amount of air to make a good sound on the recorder. Reason number two. Your fingers are not covering the holes all the way, or they're not covering them correctly. Take a look at the little boy. Look at this circle around his hands. Do you see that his fingers are not covering the holes all the way? He's definitely going to squeak when he plays. Remind yourself, your left hand is on the top and your right hand is on the bottom. I know that's hard for a lot of us because we are right-handed people, but it is the way that we need to play to make a good sound. You need your fingers completely covering the holes, or else the air might squeak out, and you don't want that to happen. You don't need to press so hard that it hurts your fingers. You just need to make sure that they're completely covering the holes. Reason number three. You're holding the recorder incorrectly. Oh my goodness, take a look at the baby here. You can tell she definitely is holding it incorrectly, and that's going to be some big squeaking that you're going to hear. So, how do we hold it correctly? Remember, again, your left hand is on the top. Sit nice and tall so that you can get some good air into your lungs, but relax your body. It does not need to be all stressed out and tense. Keep yourself relaxed and nice and tall and make sure that your recorder is pointing at a gentle angle towards the floor. Take a look at the girl in this picture. Her position is perfect. It's a gentle angle towards the floor and she's nice and tall, but she doesn't look like she's all tensed up. Her body looks nice and relaxed. She's going to be able to make a great sound. That's it for this video. I hope you had a good time watching and I can't wait to hear you in class. Good luck practicing this week. Bye.